sixth race, the Woodrow Wilson final, a purse of over 700,000. Ameripan Gigolo is peaking. Storm Island is undefeated. Oaks Enforcer, a sharp elimination winner. Ameripan Gigolo, quickest of all. Whitefish Falls settles in, and Oaks Enforcer paces on for Miller. So does Southwind Balsam up on the outside. The heavy favorite Storm Island is fifth to the opening quarter. Two lengths to Bullville in the rain, six. Prospector Hanover is seventh. Dancer's Legacy is eighth. Mr. JBB gets underway from ninth. Hawaiian Cowboys, tenth. And a bit wide there and rough gated was Southwind Balsam as Moiseev takes him to the outside. The opening quarter was Oaks Enforcer in 26 and four-fifths. Snap the opening fraction there as Storm Island and Luke Willett, that's their cue to take charge. Storm Island now by two and settles things down. Oaks Enforcer back in the second spot. Americ Pan Gigolo is third with Whitefish Falls fourth and edging out and now going up. Flushed out by Bullville in the rain. He'll pick up the cover in fifth at the half. Hawaiian Cowboy saves ground six. Prospector Hanover is seventh and it's Dancer's Legacy followed by Southwind Balsam and Mr. JBB is now at the back. The half was 55 and four so a breather for Storm Island but he's going to get heavy pressure now from Whitefish Falls on the outside. Whitefish Falls an elimination winner sticks a half length in front. Luke Willett steps on the gas on the inside with Storm Island. He can't stay with Whitefish Falls. On the outside, Oaks and Forster getting into it. Brennan has pace with Ameripan Gigolo. Three quarters, 124 and two. They're on their way home in the Wilson. And it's Whitefish Falls. Whitefish Falls and Manzi all over him. Here comes Ameripan Gigolo. He's charging late on the outside for the Red Hot George Brennan and just blows right on by. Ameripan Gigolo drawing clear. Whitefish Falls is second all out for third, Oaks and Forcer with Dancer's Legacy, 151 and two fifths. Well, the gods of racing giveth and they taketh away. George Brennan won the sweetheart earlier, but gets disqualified here with Ameripan Gigolo for coming out into number two, Bullville, in the rain when he was trying to angle clear at the top of the stretch. This horse was tons the best. So Whitefish Falls gets moved up to first for the Mayo County Stable. Robert and Carol Beltrame, they won the 95 Wilson with a stud named Sue. Trainer Bud Berg not here this evening due to a death in the family, his biggest win in some time. The Meadowlands season culminates with the 75th Hamiltonian. 